welcome to my channel, The Violently Spoken 22. My name is Nadi. This channel is for adults only. Please like, comment, subscribe if you like my channel, if you like my reading, if you like my vibe. So, this will be a general reading for my Geminis. Hi, you guys. It's me again. I know that I said I was going on a break, but I literally just cannot stay away from you guys. Okay, so when the, when when I'm being pulled to deliver the readings, I cannot hold back. Okay, and I I won't hold back and I'm not going to affect you guys with that. Okay, because the divine wants me to give these messages. So whenever they are calling, I am going to give them to you guys. I hope that you guys are doing well. Um, so yes, this will be a general reading for my Geminis. All right, take what fit, leave what doesn't. Please like, comment, subscribe to my channel if you like my reading. Help me grow. Um, I do curse Geminis. If you don't like the cursing, you can always move to another channel. Take what fit, leave what don't. Don't force anything into your life. So we're just going to be hopping into a energy check-in with you guys. I hope that y'all are doing well. I am doing well. Um, I'm going to be dishing out one more reading today for Scorpio. So if you have Scorpio on your birth chart, I also will be dishing out Sagittarius. Check those readings out as well. All right. I hope that it resonates. Okay. If it is resonating, hit that like button. And I'm going to do one more shuffle. All right. Spirit, what is the energy for my Geminis? What is the energy for my Geminis? What is the energy for my Gemini spirit? What is the energy for my Geminis? So someone could be taking action here, okay? Self-reflecting. Someone could definitely be tapping into their spiritual self, okay? Their higher self, okay? Tapping into the universe following the signs and synchronicity, start to understand the whole twin flame journey, starting to understand this whole um, universal spiritual thing, okay? Um, someone definitely has been looking at their self in the mirror, okay? Probably, you know, realizing your worth, okay? Realizing your talents, realizing that you have yourself if nobody else does. You could have been feeling, you know, drowned or just like you couldn't breathe at one point from anxiety or depression, okay? But, you know, because maybe some things or your future was hidden, your, your intuition was a bit cloudy, but I think right now you're starting to take a step back and reflect, okay, that it's you versus you. It's me versus me, basically, okay? So um, you're definitely taking a step back. You're probably doing some self-care for yourself as well. Someone could have dyed their hair. Someone could just be getting a makeover, okay? Someone could have dyed their hair red, okay? You're just cleansing your energy right now, releasing yourself from anything negative, anything that doesn't serve your highest good, okay? Um, you're covering yourself from any negative, like I said, anything negative, you don't want to see it, you don't want to hear it, you don't want to be around it, okay? You're just freeing yourself, giving yourself to the divine, tapping into your in intuition, okay? And you could be out here attracting attracting all kind of people because you look so good from the inside and out, okay? And you know, like when you have that good aura about yourself, you do attract negative energy and good energy, okay? But I feel like you are protected, okay? Um, the divine is protecting you. You are covered, all right? Um, you could be out here being attracted to some type of new creation, creation, some type of new venture for yourself, okay? And you could be out here attracted to that, taking on, you know, taking on your your soul's purpose, going on your journey, tapping in into your spiritual higher self, okay? Your purpose. And you could be definitely doing that right now, okay, Gemini? So we're going to get some energy here. I hope that you guys are doing well, but we're going to get some energy here from my other deck here. Oh, Lord, I got to get ready to start my day, you guys. So I will probably give my Scorpio reading maybe about 3 o'clock today, just depending on the energy. Maybe before that, I will try to get it out, but um, I ain't taking no breaks, okay? I'm working hard. I'm out here following my path. This is my passion giving you guys these messages, okay? And I definitely feel like 
I will take a break when the divine leads me to take a break, not when I want to take a break, okay? Because I'm just being called to give these messages out, all right? Give me more on my Gemini's um, energy spirit. Yeah, so someone could definitely be um, taking... Ref someone could definitely be seeing their self in a high uh, in high honor okay someone is realizing i am important i am it's me versus me at the end of the day i have myself all right and you're offering yourself so much self-love right now okay you have all kind of men out here attracted to you all right give me more or women okay it doesn't have to be gender specific give me more yeah, but you have this thief here wanting to come back in. This is someone who could have treated you. This is a thief who deals with scums on the street. This person could have stole from women, stole from children. This person could be, you know, bisexual. Okay, this person could hang or, you know, deal with women on the street like prostitutes. Okay, this person could... This person is just a very, like, nasty person this person wants to come in and change things around with you because they hold you in high honor but you're changing yourself you're bossing up like this is a nice ass car you guys could be getting a new car something very nice you guys could be living in a luxury apartment okay or just making a change to something very beautiful and abundant okay you could be expecting something you could be expecting a car you could be expecting this thief to come in and change things around okay but this thief is in despair right now. This thief could have a dog, okay? But this person is in despair, all dry up, okay? This person is a very cold person. This person don't have a job anymore. Yeah, but you're changing around here. You're going to be married. You're going to have all kind of good offers coming in because you are protected. You are on your spiritual journey. All of this white positive energy in the background, like you are high vibing, Gemini. Way to go. You need more. Yeah, you're going to have change. You could have had a person. You could have had a child with this person. Okay, and this person is in despair because you're going to be getting married soon. But you have this gift coming straight from the divine. Okay, you could be getting married and a child. That could be a gift from you. And look at how the divine is handing that to you. I definitely like it's When I look at that picture, it does something to me. Like, it makes me want to cry. <laughs> I don't know why. But yeah, you're becoming a privileged lady. You're finna be having all kind of good shit going on. And this person is sad. And they're going to be probably trying to hold a child against you. Putting the child in all type of issues. Because they're mad that, you know, you're moving on. You're over here loving. You over here booed up, okay? Enjoy yourself. And this person could get a message. Or this person could find out that you are over here getting all of this good, um... A lady, someone could tell this person that you're over here getting married and having a child. It could be some lady, some older lady, a cousin, a sister. Okay, but someone is going to send this person some news about you just over here doing well. And this person is going to try to come in and involve the child, try to take the child from you or something like that. Anymore. Yeah, but this person is in bad health. This person is in despair. Bad health fell right on top of despair. This person looks like they see anyways. This person is down bad because they've been out here dealing with and in bad health because they've been out here dealing with women on the streets. Okay, probably paying for sex. A mature woman could have gotten them sick. Okay, but yeah, I think I got this written before. Like, whoa, it's like, who is this sick person? All right, we're going to get some advice on um what what you guys should do what spirit wants you to do what spirit wants you to know give me some advice on my gemini spirit gratitude so this person could be grateful for you okay but gratitude expressing gratitude for where you are and what you currently have raises your vibrations and shifts your focus from lack Incorporating this into your practice can fast track manifestations and keep you in the present moment. So be grateful for what you have, okay? That will manifest, that will bring in manifestations. Being ungrateful, being kind of in that low vibrant energy, not being, um, you know, accepting of what you have. Like what I think about is sometimes I do go through my things, okay? I have my days, but I pull myself out of that negative energy because. It's somebody out here who got it worse. 
it could be worse. So, you know, spirit wants you to be grateful because you could be over here getting married, just have all this good thing coming towards you. You might not see it yet, but it's going to be coming. Change is coming. So you need to be grateful, okay? Just keep on your high-vibing journey. You might can't see what's coming towards you, okay? You don't know what is coming towards you, but change is coming, honey, Gemini. Marriage is coming, okay? Maybe a new child, if you haven't gotten a child yet, it's coming. So just be patient. Be grateful. Manifest, okay? And until next time, Gemini, bye, you guys.